Hey guys, welcome to the 46th C programming tutorial and in this tutorial we're going to be looking at the const keyword and the const keyword will basically just make it so that we can have a variable be constant meaning that we cannot change the value of that variable and it's actually really easy to do all that we need to do is just put the const keyword in front of the type name of any variable so let's just say that we wanted to create a constant integer well, all that we need to do is just write out the const keyword and then following that, just create our integer as we normally would. So I can just say const int i equals four. And like I said earlier, the const keyword will basically just make it so that we cannot change the value of a variable. So this variable called i is now constant, meaning that we cannot change the value of it. So if I go down here and try and say i is equal to two, and run this, I'm going to get an error because like I said, you cannot change the value of constant variables. And let's just go ahead and create another constant variable. We'll create a constant character. So we'll just go up here and remember, you just have to put the const variable first. So I just say const and then I just create my character variable as I normally would. So I can say car c equals f we'll say. Now I go down here and try to reassign C to something different, a different character, like a capital E, and try and run this. And again, I'm going to get the error because this uh, car is constant, so I cannot change the value of it. But just because a variable is constant doesn't mean that you can't use it. It just means that you cannot change the value of it. So if we wanted to, we could go ahead and just print out this character and it would work fine. So we can just say percent %C, uh, and the line and we'll just print out our character variable called C so now when I try and run this it'll work fine yep perfect alright so now let's go ahead and take a look at the const keyword and pointers so first let me just go ahead and create a couple integer variables and these integer variables are the variables that we're going to point to so I'm just gonna say int i equals 3 and j equals 7 all right, so here we just have a couple of integer variables, i and j, i equals three and j equals seven. All right, so now let's say that we wanted to create an integer pointer that just stores the address of i, and we wanted to make it so that we cannot change the value that this integer pointer points to. So all I have to do is just put the const keyword and then create my integer pointer as though I normally would. So I can just say int pointer ip, just stands for i pointer, and then I'll just set it equal to the address of i. All right, so since we made this pointer constant, I cannot change the value that ip points to. So if I go down here and try and dereference ip, and then set that equal to like six or something, and try and run this, I'm going to get an error. And again, that's because I made this integer pointer constant. However, putting the const keyword here does not mean that I cannot change what ip points to. So right now, I only cannot change the value that IP points to, but I can still change what IP points to. So I can go ahead right here and say IP equals the address of J, and this will work fine since I'm not changing the value that IP points to. Yep, as you can see, that worked fine. But let's say that I did want to make it so that I cannot change what IP points to. Well, what I have to do is just put the const keyword right here in between this asterisk and the name of my variable. So I just put the const keyword right there and now when I run this I'm going to get an error because I cannot change what IP points to. But since I moved this const keyword right here I can actually go back and change what IP points to. So now if I wanted to I can dereference IP and set this equal to 8 or something and now this will work fine. But if I wanted to, I could make it so that I cannot change what IP points to, and I cannot change the value that IP points to. And to do that, I just have to put the const keyword in both places. I have to put it in the front and in between the asterisks and the name of my pointer. So now, since I have the const keyword in both places, I cannot change what IP points to, and I cannot change the value that IP points to. So if I go down here, try to dereference IP, um, and set this equal to 4 and run this I'll get an error and if I try and change what IP points to so if I go down here and say IP now equals the address of J I'm going to get an error as well alright so that's pretty much it for this tutorial on the const keyword or constant variables so see you guys